like about this trip y'all the room is giving so much vibes like so much vibes which i am so excited to show y'all this room when y'all see this room like y'all probably gonna see this room right after i'm done with this talking clip y'all probably gonna see the room but y'all this room is so beautiful look the pictures didn't do no justice to how this room look in person this room is 10 times better 10 times better in person y'all and like i'm just so happy Happy to be here this is my first trip out of the country and y'all I'm just so happy and I'm just super super excited right now y'all I need to go and really pick out some clothes because we supposed to be leaving to go eat dinner at 11 I want to say 11 I think 11 p.m. We just got here. We got here at the uh, at the Airbnb at um, 6 o'clock, I want to say. We got here around 6-ish. And we had our dude, like our um, person who's over this Airbnb, he came and he gave us a tour. He gave us the keys and just everything. He was just super, super nice. He's super helpful as well. He's always helping. And y'all, I'm just so excited. This room is so beautiful, y'all. One thing I don't like, though, is the mosquitoes. The mosquitoes gotta go. The mosquitoes gotta go, but y'all gotta do me a little makeup. My hair, it look all messed up now. Like, all messed up only because I don't know, y'all. Like, I've been sleeping and everything. And, like, my baby hairs, everything is just messed up. And I gotta do my hair because I gotta get looking right, okay? I gotta get to looking good and great, okay? Don't play with your girl E because she's not what I like. She's not what I do. I don't care what any of you guys had to say. This room is top tier, baby. Top tier. Tier. Top tier. I just love it so much. My boyfriend loves it. Of course, Ted is here with me. And also, Queen and Ken is here as well. We are not in the same room. Queen and Ken has their own room and we have ours, but we in the same area. So, like, if I go outside my door where I'm at now, Queen is literally up there like in her room up there in the sh up the street so y'all i'm just i'm just so excited like this is just gonna be a great trip i pray this be a great trip well i know it's gonna be a great trip and i just hope i just really enjoy myself and enjoy the vibes like y'all i just came here and this place is just giving straight vibes 
vibes. It's giving straight vibes. Straight vibes. Vibes, vibes, vibes. It's just giving straight vibes. I love you, y'all. I'm just super excited, as y'all can see. But y'all, I need to go ahead and find my clothes, what I'm wearing. And I need to go ahead and get dressed for tonight and do my makeup and stuff. So, y'all, I will talk to y'all when I get done getting ready or when I find my clothes and stuff. So, yeah. Let me go ahead before I be late. <laughs> I am all dressed and ready. Your girl is looking good. Y'all see I got these little Versace on. Putting them to use today. But I just got on a simple little fit. I went with something simple because it's already late. And I am tired. But we probably about to go down to Queen and Ken crib. Because we ready to go. We ready to eat and we ready to go. But let me go ahead and show y'all the little fit. Look at First of all, look at Bay. Look at Bay, y'all. Uh, yeah, Bay baby. looking good. Ooh. Y'all look at him in the mirror. Let he look good. Open it, open it. Ooh, so My baby look delicious. So Ooh, slight. So slight. Baby, boy, got the Dior's on. Ooh. You feel me? You got the Serenity going on. Okay, okay. Then he got the Christian Dior's on. You feel me? Okay. Talk about it well. Get that. You feel me? Then your boy got the he Okay, we see you. We see you. Now, he go me. Ooh, look at that. She got the ooh. I just like, I got her so simple, y'all. She, she got the bad matching a with the shoes. dress with the little ooh, shoes. Ooh, see that? With the purse. Oh, y'all see black? that? Black. Black is beautiful. Got the shoes. All black with gold, boo. You know, got my little bracelets and stuff on. So, yeah. But, y'all, I'm ready to eat. I'm ready to try this I'm food, hungry, baby. I'm hungry, you guys. I haven't ate all day since we've been on the plane, since we've been on the flight. And while y'all watching this, go watch the ENT video on ENT Nation. On oh, ENT Nation, y'all make sure y'all check out the vlogs over there. And go watch ENT Reacts. We still got two videos up over there. Okay. Let there we it. go. <laughs> to y'all much since i been gone but i'm checked back in and i've been doing excursions all day since 8 a.m and now i have the time to actually pull out my camera and talk to y'all well i couldn't bring my exact camera in because they said it's not allowed but i did bring my phone and i'm saying i'm just gonna vlog off my phone but so far y'all we didn't we didn't see one um i think they call cenotes 
yeah, cenotes. We went on cenotes. We did ATV riding, which I got clips of that y'all will see. Well, probably already saw by now. And then we now we're looking at all the Mayan, the Mayan stuff with about the Mayan culture and stuff, y'all. And it's really it's really been a busy tour, but very interesting. And I'm learning new things. So and Ted over here learning new things as well. But we're gonna continue to get through this excursion, y'all, because I'm tired and I'm hot. And I want some rest. But when I get done, I'm gonna come back and I'll talk to y'all. Oh y'all, y'all see this bite under my neck? Mosquito. I got bit by a freaking mosquito, y'all. What's up, you guys? So it's been a minute since I talked to y'all. Uh, I'm currently in the pool right now. I have a lot to catch y'all up on, like literally. So, and we can start off a buy with yesterday. So can you turn the uh, waterfall off, babe? Y'all in the pool, enjoying myself in the pool. <laughs> but y'all, so it's a lot that I gotta catch y'all up on. Yesterday, what we did, babe, what we did, we did at Sturgis, right? Yeah. Yesterday, we did at Sturgis all day, which I did not forget to record for y'all. I recorded everything, all the excursions we did, y'all. We did so many. We did like probably seven or six, six or seven, y'all. And uh, it was very fun. Going through those jungles was not my kind of thing, but it ended up being fun towards the end. I ended up zip lining for the first time and canoeing which I was so afraid to do but the crazy thing is that my favorite part of all the excursions was the zip lining. I don't know. It just felt so amazing. But other than that, y'all, I have to get y'all up to date. I am a little sick. If y'all feel like I sound a little different, I did catch a little cold. Uh, only because the Airbnb was super cold and I did not know how to work the AC. So I had to suffer. But now I know how to turn it on and off. So I ended up turning all the AC units off that's inside of this Airbnb. And hopefully I feel better. But today is my last day here. I go home tomorrow and hopefully I feel better by the time I go home if I don't uh I'm gonna just get better you know I'm gonna do what I gotta do to get better but other than that y'all uh today we're supposed to go to a restaurant called taboo which is a beachfront club uh it's the beach out there they have a pool in the middle of the um restaurant they have great foods that I also hear heard about so I'm really excited to go try that as well y'all and you know just been, I just been chilling yesterday when we got back from that scourges I really just laid myself out like I laid out on the bed and I just went to sleep. Well, I took a shower, I washed my face, laid out with the sleep. I woke up in the middle of the night, just crazy. This trip just been crazy. This trip has been crazy. But I noticed I haven't been talking to y'all as much because I've been super, super busy. But I'm not gonna let my sickness stop me from having fun, okay? Um. So, man, what you about to do? What, you see something? What you see? No, can you see a lizard or something? I know, sir. So. Y'all, because he saw a lizard yesterday and blended in right with the tree. Like, I did not know what it was. But I'm just out here getting content, taking cute photos. Y'all make sure y'all follow me on the gram to check out my photos. And yeah, y'all, I'm going to catch up with y'all when I get dressed for the day and we head to top. Uh. Guys, you know you better watch out. Uh. Some girls, some girls are only about that thing, that thing, that thing. I'm not a little bit sad, but I'm a little bit kind of sad. And we're about to get ready to go, y'all. I did it. I will say, like, when I get home, I will chat up, like, my overall thoughts of the trip. But, y'all, it's currently 6. I think it's, like, 6.30. And we're currently getting our bags and stuff together because we have to get ready to go home today. We have to get ready to go home. Uh, We leave, and we got to head to the airport. The airport is about two hours away. And then we have to check in, you know, get on the plane and head back to the United States. This trip was absolutely it was fun y'all but i'm gonna give y'all my overall thoughts back when i get home but y'all just look we get all our stuff together gotta get ted's stuff and then we'll be out of here man you got everything 
But this place was super, super nice. Last night, Ted saw a big old grasshopper, y'all. I don't know what kind of grasshopper it was, but he saw it. It was inside of the pool. And I was like, oh my God, it was so big, y'all. He got a picture of it. But we, we, you know, enjoyed our last night outside and stuff and just watched TV and chill. Hi, y'all. So we are inside of the airport now from earlier when I talked to y'all. We are at the um, Cancun Airport. And I've never been in here before. And the airport is really nice. They have a lot of like luxury stores in here and the food smells really good like I'm too excited I'm ready to eat a burger y'all because this burger that I'm smelling at this place called Johnny Rockets I never heard of that but the burger smell real good I can smell it from just walking y'all so I'm about to go try this burger out and I may or may not I may give me a coffee or something I don't know just to wake me up a little bit more because I am a bit a little bit of still tired a little bit but y'all we found her some perfumes and stuff they perfumes are actually cheaper than what we pay in the U.S., which is so crazy. So I'm like, dang, we really getting charged all this money for just this. But y'all, we about to get us some food. We go to spot Johnny Rockets, y'all. I'm ready to eat. It smells so good. Ooh, I might give me a Philly cheese steak and some chicken tell us. Ooh. Y'all, I'm so ready to get home. Like, we board the plane at 11.50. We've been here for like probably an hour, two hours, something like that. But we ate the food. The burger was, it was, it was good. I mean, it wasn't bad. I give it an eight, but I'm ready for my Americano food. <laughs> hey, what's on? Got some fast skins out right now. Man, they got a laser. They over here talking about that. But y'all, we, need, we don't even have a date number yet. <laughs> Only because our plane hasn't yeah. have been landed. But I think this our plane right here. Probably waiting to get in that little cut over there. Waiting on the other plane to get out the way so he could get in the little cut and come over here so we could go home. Okay. Hey my babies. I am back and y'all can see I am back home. It's been a couple days um, since I have talked to y'all and it's been a rough little couple days because when I got home after the flight, I literally came home. Um, I tried to put stuff where it needed to go. I tried to unpack a little bit, but I couldn't really do too much because, you know, I am sick. Uh, actually, when I got home, I actually started feeling a bit worse than how I felt in Mexico. And I only think it's like that because of the weather change. Because out there, the weather is totally different from how our weather is in the U.S., so I did that. Uh, I came home. I just chilled out. Um, did it what I did what I could do, and that's about it, y'all. I am still sick, so I just been in the house. I took my wig off and everything, y'all. I just got comfortable, and I just been chilling. Um, but I hate that I'm sick right now because like I would have been to myself, you know, doing what I need to do, content, getting this videos and stuff out for y'all. So I'm sorry if y'all don't, y'all haven't got this video out fast, but it's coming. Just know it's coming. But y'all, I dropped photos on the gram. Y'all make sure y'all follow me on the gram. I dropped photos on the gram of the trip. I, overall, I really enjoyed this trip. It was my first ever trip out the country and it was so fun. It was so great to even go out the country and actually see a different Different part of the world I probably would have never thought that I would ever go to Mexico just like I just be going back and rethinking on life like I never thought that I would just be here where I am at today and just you know be in a position to even go see the other side of the world or even be in a position to be where I am in this house in this platform that I'm that I've been blessed with um, these amazing supporters who support me like I'm just so grateful for everything and I just get super excited sometimes I get emotional but I'm just super happy of like what I've been blessed with you know Tulum Mexico was most definitely fun I will go back uh, well I probably will go to Tulum again Tulum exactly but I will most definitely go back to a different part of Mexico probably Cancun or something you know because in Tulum it is a lot of partying out there now I couldn't get gritty 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 because you know I was sick but you know next time I might take a trip out there you know I'm gonna be all out there uh and next time I'll be more prepared and um I'll bring my own medication over Instead of, you know, taking Mexican, uh, their medicine, their medicine don't, doesn't hit as strong as uh, my medication does here. Like, Claritin and stuff, all that stuff is different out there. They Tylenol is different. They Claritin is different. Uh, they Mucinex is different. So, you know, even the pill sizes are different. So, when I got back here, I just started taking my regular and I'm starting to get a little bit better. Hopefully, I'll be sick for probably just like three four more like not I'm hopefully not four but I'm just gonna say three more days I'm gonna sit out for three more days and hopefully I'll be better and I can get back to myself and I'm probably actually gonna do a vlog of me you know getting back to myself after this um because 
I need my hair done. Y'all see, I didn't took off the lashes. It, it been so bad, I didn't started pulling off the lashes. And I never like really be pulling off my lashes with my hand. I always use my glue remover. So I was like, oh, I can't be pulling off my lashes. I gotta get my glue remover and take it off. So I took off my lashes today, uh, cause I was already pulling them out, but I took them out. It's just a, just, just a whole lot. But y'all, I really, well, let's, let's go take it a little back just a little bit. The excursions was really, really fun. Taboo was the best restaurant that I ate out there in Tulum. That was the best food ever. The best steak, the best flatbread, the best drink, like every, that, place was good like i love top i mean tabu it was top tier y'all top tier bok was also also good as well but not as good as tabu tabu is way better than bok i highly recommend y'all try both of those places um the shrimp that ted had i don't think i showed y'all the vlog but the shrimp that ted had at the uh place called bok it was so good like so good um i highly recommend you travel into Tulu, mexico go try out those two restaurants i also ate mexican street tacos and that was actually good and then i ate some uh a different place actually from a mayan restaurant I ate uh because they have a lot of Mayan foods out there and stuff and I ate from the Mayan restaurant and that food was actually real good as well we had pancakes for them and they just said the pancakes will actually taste like cornbread like really sweet and you know I didn't get to try it but I know that it was I know that it was really good I know it was really good and then they, they don't have like regular syrup like how we have they have like honey I think they use honey for their syrup so you know everything's pretty cool and trying different things out there is really cool lime on tacos is so good on chicken tacos pork tacos beef tacos i know i did not supposed to be eating pork but i ate pork i ate a pork i tried a pork taco and it was good like it was good with the lime chips oh my god phenomenal oh it was so good i tried guacamole y'all guacamole was so good i never had guacamole before and it was so good y'all i didn't even know guacamole was avocado why why i didn't know that first of all i feel so slow for not knowing that but that was so good i will most definitely be making that at home most definitely and yes y'all so i drove myself at the pool the private pool was so nice the uh area was so nice the airbnb was so freaking nice i really love that place the aesthetics the vibes everything i wish that i did not get sick because i could have created way more content way more tiktok content i could have got way more photos and everything inside of that place y'all but i did it but next time i go on a trip y'all just know i would have everything ready and i'll make sure i be prepared you know i was this, this sickness caught me off guard it's crazy how i'm the only one that got sick but i'm glad that i am the only one that got sick because i would want nobody else to get sick or whatever so that's why i've been isolating myself saying at home you know make sure nobody gets sick and when i wear everybody else like when i was with everybody else i made sure i wore i wore a mask after that second day after that second day i made sure i wore i wore a mask around everybody so nobody won't get sick because I don't want nobody to get sick. So, yes, y'all. Um, I enjoyed Tulu, y'all. I would rate this trip a 9 out of 10. A 9 out of 10. 9 out of 10 out of 10. Only because I got sick. But I rated a 9 out of 10. The excursions for everything. Um, the tour guides. Everybody was so great. Even the driver who drove us around. Who even drove us to get souvenirs. He was so amazing. Um, even the little girls that I bought. Um, I was buying little um, bracelets from. They were so sweet. One of them got mad at Ted, y'all. One of them got mad at Ted like they really got mad at Ted and was so mad that she stuck her tongue out and shot a bird at him because he wouldn't buy her teddy bear it was that was so crazy but I was saying that story for another time y'all I'm saying that story for another time that was so crazy but everything was so fun Ted enjoyed himself Queen Ken enjoyed himself everybody enjoyed themselves the breakfast was really really good I don't know if I, I put that in this vlog or not if I didn't put this in vlogs because the footage probably was looking crazy and I didn't want it to be looking crazy you know gotta have everything looking right but uh the breakfast was so good the uh queen can hire the chef to come over to cook us breakfast and it was so freaking good the turkey bacon the regular bacon the french toast the fruit everything was so good everything was so good and super fresh I loved it but yes y'all I'm sorry that I did not talk for majority's vlog but you did get to see a little of me I did not I next time I'll be very prepared I did not know how busy this trip would actually be but it was good I enjoyed myself and I would most definitely travel out the country again but I won't get sick next time won't get sick but y'all i hope y'all enjoyed this video y'all make sure y'all like y'all comment subscribe to the channel comment down below 
you know what was your favorite thing that you saw in this video comment down below if you know anything or no if you're getting ready to travel to mexico and this give you like little ideas to go out there and do tulum is very fun and y'all make sure y'all go out there and explore things also y'all let me know if y'all like like these travel vlogs because you know this is my very first travel vlog y'all tell me if y'all like this travel vlog and you know come up with somewhere i should go next y'all go ahead and tell me down in the comments where somewhere i should go next y'all what's somewhere i could go next and yeah Yes, that is about it. Y'all make sure y'all subscribe to the channel. And I will see y'all in the next vlog, you guys. Peace. I'm out. I will see y'all when I get better. Mm -hmm.